The hand cream camera is amazing because you don't have to worry about only having like 36 frames. Awesome, but double. Welcome to the first Europe travel series video. Uh, I just want to do a little intro before we got into the video. Our first stop on our trip was Krakow because I was doing a workshop there, a street photography workshop with Polly from the Department of Street Photography. I absolutely highly recommend uh, her workshop. It is the best street photography workshop I have ever taken. Okay. So we are in Poland, in Krakow, and I have got the camera of the day is the Fujita Half, uh, which is a half frame camera, and I've loaded it with some Color Plus. So let's go and get some shots. It is a beautiful, hot, sunny day here, and uh, yeah, can't wait to explore it. I got this processed in uh, Prague by Polygraph. I was really happy with the scans. What I did notice though, is that if, when you had a pairing, like a diptych with the half frame, because they scanned it with both the images, when those images were differed greatly in exposure, I think they probably picked one to adjust to in the scanner. And then the other one might have been under overexposed. Uh, so I think I would probably next time ask to scan it each individual frame rather than showing the two uh, side by side. So basically, we walked through Old Town, and then when you get to the south side, you sort of like cross over and you can go up the hill into the castle grounds. And there's the huge cathedral there. Um, there's like a huge open space with like a green, and there was a very interesting lawnmower. It was like a, one of those robot lawnmowers that was just going around on its own. Okay, so we're at the castle, we're at the castle, the cathedral, and I have got the like a CL with the Inox color mission in it, and um, found these amazing lounge chairs. you go around the back of that building, uh, the one that's covered in the vine and the green, there is a tower there that you can pay to enter for a small fee. 
but the views are amazing. Um, you can look over the river and it was just, it's just stunning. We actually headed back for dinner and we got some pierogies, which were awesome. Uh, but if you keep going south, you'll enter into Kazimierz, which is the Jewish quarter, and that is also amazing. So yeah, so during the workshop, we went to the Jewish quarter and we actually had a, a couple meals there that were fabulous. They were so good. One thing, so we all, obviously we tried the Polish vodka and it was delicious and they give it to you like chilled. Uh, but then we also tried this specialty that was called bison grass vodka and apparently it's, I don't know if this is actually true, but apparently it is, they make vodka from the grass that bison pee on, <laughs> which, is, which is a lovely thought. Um, but it basically just tasted like grass. So... Yeah, it, it was very interesting to try it. And now I can say that I've tried it, but um, yeah, it tastes like grass. <laughs> so that was fun. got a few obviously I'll be doing I'm gonna do little videos about everywhere we went so might do one on the salt mine next uh, so stay tuned for that and I will see you in the next one <laughs>